baptized and surrendered all to the person of the Holy Spirit. Holy Spirit, take control. Take control.
Yes, you love me so much. You went to Calvary with our sins on your shoulders, and you died for me. Just Without injustice, you are good and you are upright. Anybody ready to praise the Lord this morning? Hallelujah! I want to make a clap offering. Yes.
we exalt you this morning. You are God of promises. Our Lord, we come to lean on you because your faithfulness never fails. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We bless you. We give you glory, Jesus. We're going to do this thing.
If you're singing great, it is faithfulness to me. Let's sing it again. Great is your faithfulness to me. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. This is the day the Lord has made. 
we would rejoice and be glad in it. Welcome to Morning Glow. Welcome to another time in the presence of the Lord. It's a great day. It's going to be a great week and a great time in the presence of the Lord. Heavenly Father, we magnify you this morning. We celebrate your goodness, your faithfulness. Your faithfulness extends to the highest heavens. We ask your blessing this morning upon us. Pour out your grace. Release your power. Touch lives. Minister to your people. Let your name be glorified. We thank you, we thank you, we thank you, we thank you. We magnify you today. In Jesus' name. Amen, 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 amen. I'd like to welcome everyone who's joining us this morning. We trust the Lord that you will be blessed. And you will be ministered unto in the name of Jesus. The hand of the Lord will touch you. The hand of the Lord will minister to you. Your life will never be the same. In Jesus' name, Nekota Breko Shotaya, we welcome everybody from the four corners of the earth, wherever you are today joining us from, get ready to be blessed of the Lord, get ready for the hand of God to touch you, for the hand of God to minister to you, for the hand of God to baptize you with the grace of Jesus Christ and the power of our God, in the name of Jesus. We celebrate everybody on the platform this morning and we're praying for you that the blessing of the Lord will never cease, will never leave your house, will never leave your life in the name of Jesus. Praise the Lord. Let us know where you're joining from this morning. And by the way, do not be alone. Take your phone. Invite people from around the world. Tell them to join us for a time of devotion, a time of power, a time of grace, a time of the hand of God. A time of divine ministry. May the spirit of the living God minister to someone connected with us today. May you feel God, experience God, know God, and see him in his power today in the mighty name. Praise the Lord, praise the Lord, praise the Lord. We welcome you wherever you are from. God bless you richly. K2 Nigeria, God bless you this morning. Malaysia, blessings of God on you today. In the mighty name of Jesus, Lebro Shayaniri, Bristol. God bless you richly this morning, Bristol in fish ponds. God bless you. Dekula, Georgia. God bless richly. In Jesus' name, Logia in France. May you be blessed in our favorite Plumstead, Southeast London. The Lord bless you richly, Hounslow. Uh, that is the extreme end, West London. God bless you this morning. Bedfordshire, God bless you richly. In Jesus' name, Lusaka, Zambia. Be blessed, be favored, be lifted. In the name of Jesus, Kadish, Brotally, Buttonsville, Maryland. The Lord bless you this morning. Uh, Peckham in East Peckham in East London, in South East London, rather. God bless you this morning. Blessings. Bracknell, blessings. Tolls Hill, blessings. Uh, Abidjan in Ivory Coast. Diovu Benis. Uh, Thailand in Bangkok. Blessings be on you today. In the name of Jesus. Coast and in Surrey. The Lord bless you richly. In the name of Jesus, Rochester in Kent. Be blessed, be favored, be lifted. Uh, Bismarck in Ghana. I don't know where Bismarck in Ghana is. I'd like to know. God bless you this morning, Jesus' name. Uh, lady, 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 Roman Ridge in Accra, Ghana. Again, God bless you this morning. Maseru in Lesotho. The Lord bless you richly today in the Lesotho Kingdom. Blessings on you, blessings on you. Bedford, blessings, Walton Cross. Be blessed. The Emirate of Ajman, that is in the United Arab Emirates. God bless you richly today. South Korea, hey, God bless you this morning. In South Korea, in Jesus' name. Uh, Croydon, be blessed, be highly favored. Democratic Republic of Congo, God bless today. Beaver Creek, Ohio, may you be blessed. 
na lishi doza rikondoriri ndariro roza ya in the name of jesus may the hand of the lord touch you today in the name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus we celebrate each one charlotte north carolina the lord bless you ireland uh i didn't see the city god bless you this morning hackney london blessings on you Braintree in Essex, be blessed, be favored. Satellite Town, Lagos, Nigeria. The Lord bless you richly today. Centurion, South Africa, be blessed and highly favored. Richmond Hill, Georgia, be blessed and highly favored. Uh, Houston, Texas, blessings on you today. Richmond Hill, Georgia, blessings. Doaki Extension in Abuja. May you be blessed. May you be favored. Place to in East London. God bless you richly today. Kinshasa. May you be blessed in Jesus' name. Praise the Lord. Tet for it. God bless you richly. In the name of the Lord, Warwickshire, blessings, Salisbury, Wiltshire, God bless you richly this morning. Uh, I'd like to encourage you one more time, wherever you are this morning, to please take the time. Invite somebody to be with us on the platform. Let them experience the grace of God, the blessing of the Lord. Tripoli in Libya, God bless you this morning. Bagada, Lagos, Nigeria, blesses. Leeds, God bless you. Kasua, Millennium City, and Kasua, Ghana, God bless this morning. Hoxton in Hackney, London, blessings. Custom House East London, be blessed. Be favored in Jesus' name. Let there be a lifting in your life today. A lifting in your life. Westminster Bridge, God bless you richly. Asaba Delta State, Nigeria, God bless you richly. Middleton Cork in Ireland, God bless you richly today. KT in Texas, God bless you this morning. KD, Texas, blessings. Uh, Essen in Germany, blessings. Catford, Southeast London. We speak blessings on you this morning. We bless every one of you. We speak grace upon grace wherever you have joined from, whether we mentioned it or not. Bucharest, Romania. The Lord bless you richly this morning. Padova in Italy. Be blessed and highly favored today. Pleasanton, California, the Lord bless you richly today, in Jesus' name. Olodo, uh, Olodo Ibado, Nigeria, God bless you richly today. Clapton, London, blessings. Uh, Yemosha, Juliet Godman in Ghana, I don't know where that is. Is it a person? Is it an estate? There is Juliet Godman in Ghana. God bless you this morning. In the name of Jesus, may you be favored. Sudden and sorry blessings. Peter Marisburg, may you be blessed. May you be favored. May you be lifted. In the name of Jesus, the life will never be the same. We'd like to welcome everyone who's joining us on Morning Glow today. We pray the blessings of the Lord, the grace of Jesus Christ, the mercy of God to rest on you, the hand of God to rest on you in the mighty name of Jesus. You will not fail. You will not be put to shame and uh, you will not be disappointed. Rather, grace upon grace, favor upon favor, blessing upon blessing. And the celebration that you are going to take in or you are going to step into in this season of your life, nothing can stop it. In Jesus' name.
This morning we're praying the Psalms. We're speaking the Psalms into our life. We're prophesying the Psalms into our life. David had a habit of worshiping God and blessing the Lord whenever he faced anything. He knew how to, according to the scriptures, 1 Samuel chapter 30, verse 6, he knew how to encourage himself in the Lord. He didn't wait for his pastor. He didn't wait for his friends. He didn't wait for neighbors. Men are, are, are flaky. People are funny. They can change. They can move on from your life. But when your eyes are on God, you can find answers, solutions in the name of Jesus. He found himself worshiping God many times. He faced challenges in life. He was pursued by King Saul. He, was barely, he had barely escaped assassination attempts. He had to spend time in wilderness one time. His entire family was, was kidnapped. His entire family of King David was kidnapped. And he had to pursue, overtake, and recover all. His friends turned against him and were ready. His best counselor deserted him to go and join his son who was in rebellion. His son Amnon, Amnon raped his daughter Tamar. His other son Absalom murdered Amnon. Absalom led a revolt against David. Absalom himself was killed and David was heartbroken. All these made David to know how to worship God, how to encourage himself. You, you would think that having been ordained three times, anointed three times, he would not, he would not uh, experience the pain he experienced and he would not be attacked in the way he did. But challenges do not exclude anyone. He had to go through things, so he knew how to encourage himself. The Bible says, and David strengthened himself in the Lord. He encouraged himself in the Lord. So when uh, King Saul was pursuing David, David encouraged himself in the Lord by writing the whole song. Psalm 59 verse 1 to 4 was written during the pursuit of Saul. Deliver me from my enemies, O oh my God. Defend me from those who rise up against me. Deliver me from the workers of iniquity. Save me from bloodthirsty men. For look, they lie in wait for my life. The mighty gather against me, not for my transgression, not for my sin, O oh Lord. They run and prepare themselves through no fault of mine. When he was imprisoned, one time they imprisoned poor David in Gath, the land of the Philistines. He wrote Psalm 56, verse 1, And to be merciful to me, O God, for man will swallow me up. Fighting all day, he oppresses me. My enemies will hound me all day, for there are many who fight against me most high. When his son was, was pursuing him, Absalom was pursuing his own dad to kill him. David wrote the popular Psalm 3. Lord, how, have in, how they have increased who troubled me. Many are they who rise up against me. Many are they who say of me, there is no help for him in God. But thou, O Lord, art a shield for me, my glory and, my, and the lifter of my head. I will not be afraid of ten thousands of people. This is when his own son was pursuing him. We must know how to draw from the word. So from Psalms this morning, we're going to prophesy into our lives. Prophesy healing, protection, provision, supernatural grace, abundance. They're all in the Psalms. David did not write all of them. He was the editor who brought all together. He wrote over 72 of them. When he was hiding in the wilderness, he wrote Psalm 63. When he, when he learned that things are about to happen to him that will really hurt him, and he learned how to put his trust in God, he wrote Psalm 56, verse 3 to 4, verse 9 to 11. Whenever I am afraid, I will trust in you. In God, I will praise his word. In God, I will put my trust. I will not fear what man can, what can flesh do to me. When I cry unto you, then my enemies will turn back. These I know because God is for me. 
in God I will praise his word. In the Lord I will praise his word. Praise the Lord. When David was determined, I mean David was determined to continue to seek God for help. That's another thing he did. He wrote Psalms determining that he will get help from God. He will get help from God. And he kept praising the Lord. He kept praising the Lord. Psalm 56 verse 16 and 17. I will sing of your power. Yes, I will sing aloud of your mercy in the morning. For you have been my defense and refuge in the day of trouble. To you, O oh my strength, I will sing praises. For God is my defense. My God my of mercy. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. He overcame his problem of loneliness. He wrote Psalm 63, verse 1 and 2. O oh God, you are my God. Early will I seek you. My soul thirsts for you. My flesh longs for you in a dry and thirsty land where there is no water. So I have looked for you in the sanctuary to see your power and your glory. You've got to learn how to encourage yourself, how to draw strength from the word of God. David didn't just draw strength. He wrote those Psalms to lift his spirit. He also talked about meditating on God. He talked about how to meditate on God, how to wait on God, how to hear from God. Psalm 63, verse 6 and 7, When I remember you on my bed, I meditate on you in the night watches, because you have been my help. Therefore, in the shadow of your wings, I will rejoice. Glory to God. Glory to God. Glory to God. So you must learn how to draw strength from God. In time of trouble, put your trust in the Lord. David wrote all this in the Psalms. Stay close to God. Through praising him and praying to him, stay close to God. Do this and you will be made strong as the Lord supports you. Psalm 63 verse 8, my soul follows close behind you. Your right hand upholds me. This was how David strengthened himself in the Lord his God. He was able to face and overcome the problem with the help that God gave him. So this morning, you need to understand, as a believer, you face challenges. You can't run away from them, but God will help you. The Holy Ghost will help you. Power of God will be in your life. Some of us are facing uh, family problems. God will intervene. Some are facing personal challenges. As we read the Psalms, as we look at the Psalms, there'll be a way out. Some are facing things that have to do with their job. There'll be a divine intervention. Some financial security, there'll be answers. There'll be solutions in the name of Jesus. And some, uh, they, 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 they try to tackle their own problem alone instead of looking to God. Don't forsake the Lord. Do not abandon his word. Do not abandon his way. He will show up for you. And David also in Psalm 118, he made us understand. Once you have God on your side, everything is okay. You have the majority. He said, the Lord is on my side. What can man do unto me? The Lord is on my side. What can man do unto me? So what is the worst thing they can do to me? Kill me? Uh, there's nothing they can do. Once you have the Lord on your side, you have the victory, you have the testimony in the name of Jesus. Oh, glory to God this morning. Glory to God this morning. Glory to God this morning. Father, we bless you. We thank you for the word. We thank you, your word of life, your word of deliverance. Somebody is having victory today. Somebody is having grace in their life. Favor is flowing in their life. The hand of the Lord is being stretched. The might of God is shown in their life. The testimony of Jesus Christ is shown in, in their life in the name of Jesus. God will stir, set you free, bless you. Why? In Psalm 91, he said, because he has set his love on me. Because he has set his love on me. Because you have set your love on God, you're going to have answers, solution. He said, because he has known my name. Because you have known the name of the Lord, you will have solutions and answers. He shall call upon me. Ah, as you call upon the Lord, he will show up for you. He will prove himself as a mighty God in your life. He said, because I know him and love him. Glory to God. 
God will show up for you and prove himself as a mighty God. As we pray the Psalms this morning, may you see the hand of God. May you see the glory of God. May you see the favor of God. May you see the blessings of God. May you see the grace rising for you. Let's open the heavens with thanksgiving and praise. Nadish tedu talish kayanabakada. The temptation of the human heart is to want to quickly rush and ask your own thing. Give me, give me, give me, give me, give me. But the Lord wants us to learn how to just magnify him, how to just praise his name and make great his name from the rising of the sun to the going down of it. How to lift up the name of the Lord, how to make great his name. Praise the Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Oh, praise the Lord. Psalm 100 from verse 1 to 5. Shout for joy to the Lord, all the earth. Worship the Lord with gladness. Come before him with joyful songs. Know that the Lord is God. It is he who made us. We are his people, the sheep of his pasture. We also shout for joy that we are counted among the living. We are here this morning celebrating the goodness of God, the might of God, the grace of God. Be glorified this morning. We magnify you. Devil, you cannot touch what belongs to us. So the Bible says, enter his gates with thanksgiving. Psalm 100 verse 4. And his court with praise and give him and give thanks to him and praise his name. For the Lord is good and his, and his love endures forever. So this morning we enter the gates of God with thanksgiving. We enter his courts with praise. We come magnifying Jesus. We make his name great make his name great we make his name great we make his name great in the name of jesus in jesus name psalm 34 verse 1 to 9 i will extol the lord at all times his praise will always be on my lips i will glory in the lord let the afflicted hear and rejoice this morning we make great your name. We lift you up. We make your name great. We make your name great. We exalt you, O oh God. Your glory is in among us. Your power, your glory is among us. Your power is among us. Your name is among us. Ah, thank you, Jesus. The afflicted are hearing and they are rejoicing. They are finding healing. They are finding favor. They are finding testimony. It's going to be a beautiful week. It's going to be a great week. For this, we magnify you. Thank you, Jesus. For answered prayers, we magnify you this morning. Psalm 34 from verse 4. I, I, I sought the Lord. He answered me. He delivered me from all my fears. Those who look to him are radiant. Their faces are never covered with shame. <laughs> Hallelujah. Thank you. Thank you. We called you. You answered. We prayed to you. You made it happen. You stretched your hand. You proved yourself. You healed us. We have catalogs of testimonies of your healing grace, of your healing power, of your healing grace, of your healing power. This poor man called and the Lord heard him. He saved him out of all his troubles. The angel of the Lord encamps around those who reverently fear him. And he delivers them. Lord will bless you for answered prayer, for deliverance, for healings, for miracles. For the outstretching of your hand to prove yourself as a mighty God. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Be blessed. Oh, Jesus, be blessed this morning. We adore you. We magnify you in Jesus' name. Ah, Psalm 111, verse 1 to 5. Praise the Lord. I will extol the Lord with all my heart. In the council of the upright and in the assembly. Great are the works of the Lord. They are pondered by all who delight in them. Glorious and majestic are his deeds, and his righteousness endures forever. He has caused his wonders to be remembered. The Lord is gracious and compassionate. He provides food for those who reverently fear him. He remembers his covenant forever. Lord, we thank you. Your works are great. Your healing is great. Your outstretched hand in our life is mighty. There is none like you, none so glorious, none so powerful we bless you this morning we say you are god from beginning to the end no room for argument no room for doubt take the glory today 
take the praise our savior we praise you we praise you from everlasting to everlasting we love you from everlasting to everlasting we celebrate you from everlasting to everlasting in jesus name and now lord we thank you for what you have done in our personal lives psalm 103 we want to read a few verses praise the lord my soul all my innermost being praise his holy name Praise the Lord my soul and forget not all his benefits who forgives all your sins. Father, we thank you for washing us with your blood, for giving all our sins and writing our name in the book of life. We thank you. We thank you not by the works we have done, but by the finished work you have done on the cross of Calvary. Take the glory this morning. Take the honor this morning. To you be glory. To you be praise. To you be glory. To you be praise. In the name of Jesus. Oh, in the name of Jesus. Who forgives all your sins. Who heals all your diseases. We thank you for your power. That sets us free from every demonic activity. From every power of the enemy. To you be glory today. To you be praise. We love you, Lord. We celebrate you, Father. We make great your name. Who redeems your life from the pit and crowns you with love and compassion. You drew us, you drew us out of the pit, out of a horrible ground. We thank you. You satisfy our life with good things so that our youth is renewed as the eagles. Be glorified, be honored, be lifted. The Lord walks righteousness and justice for all the oppressed. We thank you for your hand of justice and your hand of righteousness. We thank you for proving yourself. Thank you for saving us, delivering us. Thank you for shutting the mouth of devils. In the name of Jesus, we bless you, 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 we bless you. This morning, be glorified. In Jesus' name. This morning, we're praying Psalm 18. How I love the Lord. You are my defender. Lord, we thank you because you are a defender. This morning, we release the defense of God for somebody wherever you are and anywhere you are working. You, on, or you already know you are in a place of clear and present danger. God will defend you. 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 We release warrior angels. 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 Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. The Lord is my protector. He is my strong fortress. My God is my protection, and with Him I am safe. He protects me like a shield. He defends me and keeps me safe. This morning, we prophesy divine protection over somebody's life. Nato Shekaya, in this season, the protection of the Lord will not cease from your life. The protection of the Lord will not cease from your life. We declare and decree the protection of the Lord will not cease from your life. The protection of God will be around you. No weapon formed against you will ever prosper. Every mouth that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned at this period. The hand of the Lord's protection, the grace of the Lord's protection will be upon your life, will be over your life. In the name of Jesus, every arrow, every arrow sent against you shall not walk. In the name of Jesus, protection from attacks of men protection from the tongue 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 of men we judge we sentence we imprison every tongue that have risen against you speaking evil attempting to frustrate god's plan for your life in the name of jesus we protect you their arrows their weapons, their word shall not work. Their arrows, their words shall not stand. It 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 shall not stand. 
He shall not stand in the name of Jesus. He shall not stand in the name of Jesus. He shall not stand. Every gathering against you and your household will be confounded and scattered in the name of Jesus. For the Bible says, Behold, all they that were incensed against thee shall be ashamed and confounded. They shall be as nothing. They shall strive and they shall and they that strive with thee shall perish. Psalm 41 verse 11. So every gathering, every demonic gathering, every whispering gathering, every gossip gathering, every attack gathering against your destiny, against your life, will bring divine protection over you. We speak divine protection over you. Kairesha totorini kiska renambre dojeli kalibra no sorai. We speak divine protection over your life. We speak divine protection over your life. We speak divine protection over your life. In the name of Jesus, arrows are failing. Arrows of darkness are failing. Arrows of darkness are failing. In Jesus' name. Isaiah 41 verse 10 says, Fear not, for I am with thee. Be not dismayed, for I am your God. I will strengthen you. I will help you. I will uphold you with my right hand of righteousness. So this morning I speak into your life. Nothing will make you afraid. Nothing will make you afraid. God will help you. He's holding your hand. He's seeing you through. He's holding your hand. He's seeing you through. That big project in your spirit will become reality. That dream you have had will become reality. That vision you have had will become reality. Kaya, talo, skirira, terodo, sheteika, kapro, sota, li, parano, sikia. I declare upon somebody this morning the power of God's protection against weapons of darkness, against arrows of darkness, wherever it is coming from, anyone who hides in darkness and shoots arrows. The arrows ricochet, the arrows return and hit them back. In the name of Jesus, say amen with power wherever you are. In the name of Jesus. Alebosha, Rikurosa, Hiradikera, Hirabakatea. The Bible says, Whosoever is born of God does not commit sin, for the seed of God is in him. So you carry the seal of God upon your life. The Bible says, They are sealed until the day of redemption. So this morning, I declare to your life, it is already. <laughs> God has already written on your life, touch not, my anointed. So you are Mrs. Touch not, Mr. Touch not. Anyone who have raised their hand, their voice to touch you, to touch your life, to touch your destiny. Ah, God will help you. God will fight for you. God will help you. God will fight for you. God will help you. God will fight for you. God will help you. He said, touch not. So you are Miss Touch not, Mrs. Touch not, Mr. Touch not. Ah. Must touch not. We declare this morning that by the hand of God you are protected. To destroy you, to hurt you, they will carry it with their own head. They will carry it with their own head. They will carry it with their own head. Favor rests on you. Peace rests on you. Grace rests on you. Blessing rests on you. In the name of Jesus. Nalish Kayedada, Hiraba Kali Rida, Nalisha, Hiraba Katayara. We put an end to perpetual fear in your life. Fear of this. They will do this to me. They will do that to me. No weapon formed against you will prosper. Every mouth that rises against you in judgment shall be condemned. Their garden will be frustrated. Their program will be frustrated in the name of Jesus. Isaiah 8, verse 9 and 10. Isaiah 8, verse 9 and 10. Associate yourself, you people. I mean, and you, and you shall be broken in pieces. And give ear, all you of far countries. Guard yourself. You shall be broken in pieces. Guard yourself. And you shall be broken in pieces. Take counsel together. It shall come to nothing. Speak the word. It shall not stand. For God is with us. I prophesy on your life this morning that God is with you. 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 Maledesha, Rikedozi. God is with you. God is protecting you. God is keeping you. As they associate, they will fail. If God is for us, who can be against us? Talaribishanaya, Talerikabara, 
Ronante libunga reteda lereda taroski talida. This morning, by the might of God and the hand of God, we release protection in your life. We declare that the weapons of the enemy fail. In Jesus' name, they 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 fail. Arrows of darkness fail for you. Everywhere they go, whatever they do to try to bring you down, it shall not work. It shall not work. I declare and decree that angels take charge of your movements. They hereabo shada, hereo kosala. No accidents, no danger. Come in near your dwelling place. Only the hand of God, only the grace of God, only the power of God. In the name of Jesus. God himself will prove himself in your life, in your life, in your life, in your life, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus, in the name of Jesus. I declare to your life today that as you go out, you'll be led forth with peace. Mountains and hills will break forth with singing before you, and you will come back testifying. Psalm 18, from verse 3, I call to the Lord. He saved me from my enemies. Praise the Lord. The danger of death was all around me. The waves of destruction rolled over me. The danger of death was around me. And the grave set up, sets its trap for me. In my trouble, I called upon the name of the Lord. I called upon the Lord. I called to my God for help. In his temple, he heard my voice. He listened to my cry. This day I stand on this altar and I prophesy unto your life. Anyone who is surrounded by the danger of death, anyone who is surrounded by the waves of destruction, we cancel it with the blood of Jesus. We cancel it with the blood of Jesus. The danger of death, the grave will not see you. The grave will not see you. You are not a candidate of the grave. Hand of God, peace of God, grace of God, hand of God, peace of God, grace of God, hand of God, peace of God, grace of God, on your life in this season. That I read this one again. The danger of death surrounded me. It was David's victory song. The waves of destruction rolled over me. The danger of death was around me. Grave set its trap for me. In my trouble, I called upon the Lord. I called to my God for help. In his temple, he heard my voice. He listened to my cry for help. God will hear you. God will deliver you. 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 Alende roshe kayari kalibare ke toromazia ilibarada de roshe kayere habare roro kariyara da irikara baraso ilirada da 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 iribarosha ikaliriba ikarada osi irinari tora ipra ito shandiliria ikaribo italirika ikarada ba I declare to your life this morning God will hear you God will deliver you God will hear you God will deliver you no danger comes near your dwelling place. Every evil set up against you shall not work in the name of Jesus. Verse 7, then the earth trembled and shook. The foundations of the mountains round rocked and quivered because God was hungry. Smoke out of his nostril, consuming flame, burning coals from his mouth. He tore the sky open. He came down with a dark cloud under his feet. He swift, he flew swiftly on his winged creature. He traveled on the wing on the wings of the wind. He covered himself with darkness. Thick clouds full of water surrounded him. Hailstone and flash of fire came from the lightning before him. And he broke through the dark clouds. And he broke through the dark clouds. And he broke through the dark clouds. Everyone on this altar today who is surrounded by all kinds of dark clouds, financial dark clouds, I command you to leave in the name of Jesus. Physical dark clouds, I command you to leave that shadow over your house, over your life right now. That uncertainty, I break it, break it, break it, break it, break it, break it, break it. In the name of Jesus, that cloud over your home, that cloud over your life, I break it, I break it. I break it. I break it. 
I break it. Naloshita yiza. Marike tolozia. Narandero teli. Riki kosomai. Nabare toloza. Riki torimanteli. Jaleribo kosiata. Rine ketali riboro. Riki solara mateli. Rimetolora mekedori. Zanderish tolebrai. Hikalorona anteleba. Riki toso lebrente. Hibroli de shekayereba. Hikabara sotele rekereba. Ramatoloro barike seleria. Heno taliri bareko shotolari. Hiketoro seketelereba. From today, a new season, a new level, a new change, a new power comes upon your life, comes upon your house, comes upon your life, comes upon your house, comes upon your life, comes upon your house, comes upon your life, comes upon your house in Jesus' name. Then the Lord turned out from the sky, and the voice of the Most High was heard. He shot, he shot his arrows and scattered the enemies. With flashes of lightning, he sent them running. The floor of the ocean was laid bare. Foundations of the earth were uncovered. When you rebuked your enemies, Lord, and roared at them in anger. This morning, anything that I've gathered together to make life frustrating for you in this season, God roars upon them. God scatters them. Ah, Leboshka, Hita, Hidurunda, Hika, Prenosia, Hitele, Hishkaira, Hikaradosa. Everything that I've gathered that we scattered them. Rather, there will be months of blessing, months of favor, months of grace, months of glory in Jesus' name. Verse 16 The Lord reached down from above and he took hold of me. He pulled me out of deep waters. He rescued me from powerful enemies, from all those who hate me. They were too strong for me. When I was in trouble, they attacked me, but the Lord protected me. He helped me out of danger. He saved me because he was pleased with me. This morning I speak into your life. Out of troubled waters, God is pulling you out. Out of troubled waters, the Lord is pulling you out. Out of challenges, the Lord is pulling you out. Out of marital issues, the Lord is pulling you out. Out of financial battles, dark clouds, he reached down. He pulled me out. Oh, wow. He reached down from above and took hold of me. He pulled me out. He reached down from above. He took hold of me. Then he pulled me out. God is bringing you out. Somebody ought to say amen where they are. He's bringing you out of that thing you are looking at, the issue you are looking at. God is bringing you out in the name of Jesus. God is bringing you out in the name of Jesus. In this season of your life, God is bringing you out with a mighty hand, with an awesome hand, with a powerful hand. God is bringing you out with an awesome power. God is bringing you out. With grace upon grace, God is bringing you out. With the kind of power you have never seen, God is bringing you out. Nalisha, Hirika, Hirika, Hirira, Hira, Zumbra, Teja, Rikusa, Lerita, Hirida, Dada, Hirida, Rukusu, Liriba. He reached down out of the dark clouds. He picked me up. He pulled me out. You are coming out of financial situations. You are coming out of physical battles. You are coming out of family issues. You are coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. You are coming out. The hand that created the earth, the hand that created the world that molded you, is stretched this morning to bring you out. To bring you out. Men thought it's over. God showed himself. Men thought it's over. God will show himself. When men say it is over, God will say it is not. When men say it is over, God will say it is not. When men say it is over, God will say it is not. Thank you, Jesus. Ah! God will stretch his hand. God will move mightily. God will stretch his hand. God will move mightily. God will stretch his hand. God will move mightily. God will stretch his hand. God will move mightily. 
kai kutura gigigi zaramosha thank you jesus oh glory to god oh glory to god for the lord himself will move mightily in your life he reached down from above and took hold of me he pulled me out of deep waters he rescued me from powerful enemies and from those who hate me everything that i've ganged up to make your life uncomfortable they're turning around for your good 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 in the name of jesus for the lord himself who stretch his hand prove himself show up for you stretch his hand show up for you stretch his hand show up for you stretch his hand show up for you in the name of jesus naye rarosha akaye rebosa naye he kalara he rarosa nakaye rebo verse 28 oh lord you give me light you dispel darkness you give me strength you attack my enemies and power to overcome their defenses this day i pray for you light will shine light will shine in your way light will shine for progress wisdom for progress light will shine in your way ideas ideas solutions are coming to you solutions are coming to you answers are coming to you solutions are coming to you answers are coming to you solutions are coming to you answers are coming to you solutions are coming to you in the name of jesus in the mighty name of jesus oh lord you give me light you dispel darkness you give me strength to attack my enemies and power to overcome their defense light will shine in your way the kind of light that makes a man to have answers solutions to the th- to the riddles of life receive answers receive answers receive answers financial answers physical answers health answers family answers spiritual answers situation answers receive it 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 in the name of jesus ah this god verse 30 this god how perfect are his deeds how dependable his words He's a he's like a shield for all who seek his protection. The Lord alone is God. God alone is our defense. He is the God who makes me strong, who makes my pathway safe. He makes me sure-footed as a deer. He keeps me fr- safe on the mountains. He trains my hand for battle so that I can use the strongest bow. Ah from this passage I read to you this morning I declare to you in the name of Jesus God goes with you in the name of Jesus his word will be dependable everything God spoke kaka to saitai rana te kotoreba do itaris wait for it it shall become reality in your life every prophetic word personal and corporate that God has spoken concerning you your eyes will see it your hands will handle it your eyes will see it your hands will handle it your eyes will see it your hands will handle it your eyes will see it in the name of Jesus aye kate so taliga zalidida jararidi ranarida talizari zarikaya rekarada his his word is dependable every prophetic word god gave you shall become reality shall become reality in the name of jesus in the name of jesus ola boshada hiriririra hiraradarara hiraradirira hiraradarara hikalaradara is like a shield for all who seek his protection this day god will protect you he will be the shield around your life arrows will fail arrows will fail for your sake in this season of your life irora roshedara the lord alone is god god alone is our defense he is the god who makes me strong who makes my paths way safe this morning i speak into your life God goes with you. God gives you victory. God gives you testimony. God turns situations around in the name of Jesus. Protection around you. The word of God fulfilled. The hand of God stretched out 
in Jesus' name. The passage which we read says, he makes me sure-footed as a deer. In other words, he makes me <laughs> jump like hind feet. He keeps me safe on the mountains. He trains me for battle. Sure-footed as a deer from this day. You are moving fast. You are moving into testimony seasons. You are moving into glory seasons. You are moving into greatness seasons. I speak into your life today as you go into the day. Let the city open for you. Let the nation open for you. Let the places open for you. Let this week open for you. Let them open for you. Let every hour open for you. Let every minute open for you. Let every second open for you. This week you will be fulfilled. You will be achieving. You will break grounds. You will do exploits. The hand of the Lord will be mighty. The grace of the Lord will be awesome. The hand of the Lord will be mighty. The grace of the Lord will be awesome. In the mighty name of Jesus, you are coming back with testimony. In Jesus' name, these days will be awesome for you. In Jesus' name. Psalm, 44, Psalm 18 verse 44. Foreign house bow before me. When they hear me, they obey. They lose their courage and come trembling from their fortress. Everything that is foreign to your blessing and foreign to your joy, they bow to your God. They bow to your prayer. Sickness is a foreigner. It bows to your prayer. It bows to your God. Challenges are, 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 are going to bow in the name of Jesus. Battles you have known, they are foreigners. They will bow. 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 They will bow in the name of Jesus. I declare to your life this day. This psalm was written by David when he was pursued by a man bigger than him, taller than him, stronger than him, still occupying the street that belonged to David. And yet David was not the one coming to chase the man out of the seat. But it was the man that was chasing David. But the Lord, if God be for us, who can be against us? This day I prophesy unto your life. Strangers, 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 strangers. strangers. They are now strangers because they are occupying what belongs to you. Strangers, God is chasing them out of your blessing. God is chasing them out of your destiny. God is chasing them out of your future. God is chasing them out of your destiny. God is chasing them out of your future. God is chasing them out of your blessing. Akito Shena, Neri Ketozo, Renem Bredosha, Neli Ingerosete, Rato Libre Keta, Renosh Kayenderi Talibra Dozali. In the name of Jesus, in the mighty name of Jesus, God goes ahead of you, defeating mighty armies. Defeat in mighty names. Anything that looks so daunting and so big. Peace, 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 peace. Joy, joy, joy. Glory, glory, glory. Favor, 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 favor. In the name of Jesus. Verse, 60, verse 50, the last verse. God gives great victory to his king. He shows constant love to the one he has chosen, to David and his descendants forever. God will give you victory. God will show you his love. God will bless you and your descendants. In the season of your life, the doors will open. In the mighty name of Jesus, wherever you are, please say powerful amen to the, to the prophetic word. I declare into your life, from this day that these blessings follow you, they overtake you, they follow you, they overtake you. I declare to your life, you will be head and not the tail. You will be the head and not the tail. You will be the head and not the tail. You will always be at the top, never below. Always be at the top, never below. Anyone on this platform this morning will remove depression, will release joy, will we'll remove depression. We supply joy unspeakable. Joy shall be your strength. Grace shall be your strength. Joy shall be your strength. And this week, you'll be blessed going out. You'll be blessed coming in. 
Psalm, Deuteronomy 28 verse 6. You'll be blessed going out. You'll be blessed coming in. During today and during this week, you can do all things. Grace to do it will come. Philippians 4.13. Philippians 4.13. You can do all things. During this week, 2 Timothy 1.7. Everything that I've gone up trying to scare you. Men who have written. Men who have spoken. Men who have maligned. People who have said things to try to control you. To try to control your mind. Their power is broken. Peace upon your life grace upon your life in the name of Jesus this morning I prophesy into your life you will not be afraid your God will be with you Isaiah 41 verse 10 your God will strengthen you and help you Isaiah 41 verse 10 his stripes will heal you by his stripes you are totally healed you are to I can see somebody you've just lost taste of food and you don't know what it is. Well, we don't know what it is, but we lay hand on you. We command your health and healing in the name of Jesus. There's a strange illness on somebody I see. It's as if your body, I don't know how to describe it. It's almost practically trying to say your body is breaking off like with sores. So I lay hand on you this morning. Whatever caused it, if it's sin, we ask for forgiveness. We command your healing in the name of Jesus. In the mighty name of Jesus. This morning I declare into your life total health, total deliverance. Victory. This week will be a week that you will be a new creature. You are walking in your new creatureness as a child of God. 2 Corinthians 5.17 This week you are delivered from the power of darkness. That darkness will not prevail in your life. This week you will know that greater is he that is in you than he that is in the world. This week you will know that the Spirit of God dwells within you. This week you will know that you walk by faith and not by sight, and you are totally victorious. No weapon formed against you will prosper. Every tongue that spoke against you in judgment is condemned. This week God richly supplies all your need according to his riches in glory. This week the manifestation of a child of God Loved by God, carrying grace shall be on your life. This week, God is with you who can be against you. No weapon formed against you will prosper. This week, no one can separate you from the love of God. This week, the Lord is your shepherd, you shall not want. This week, all your cares are cast upon the Lord. He cares for you, so you will not fail. This week, you will receive you will receive. You will receive blessing with good measure. Pressed down, shaken together. Running over. This week, you'll be a lender, not a borrower. You will be a lender, not a borrower. This week, Philippians 1, 6. Every good thing God began, God will finish. Every good thing God began, God will finish. Every good thing God began, God will finish. Every favor God began, God will finish. Every blessing God began, God will finish. You will not be anxious for anything. But in everything through prayer and supplication, all your requests will be made, will be satisfied. The peace of God that passes understanding will keep your mind during this week. The grace of God will abound for you during this week. The blessing of the Lord will not cease from your house. In the name of Jesus. During this week, you are released from all manners of attack. During this week, you are called to a level of grace and glory. You are called to virtue. During this week, you will see the hand of the Lord in every situation and at all times. Jeremiah 33 verse 3. You will see God's hand. You will see his power at work at all times. In the name of Jesus. During this week, uh, you will not be shaken. You will not be envious of others. You will not lose hope. Because God will be your strength. God will be your trust. The Lord will keep you from falling. In the name of Jesus. Blessing rests on you. Grace rests on your life. In Jesus name. Amen. Amen. 
Amen. Oh, glory, 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 glory this morning. This week you will not be ashamed of the gospel of Jesus Christ. You will declare it to people. You will share it with people. Your past hurts and disappointments will not stop your coming blessing in the name of Jesus. So the shout of joy shall be in the assembly of the righteous. It shall be in your assembly. It shall be in your camp. Jesus name Amen Praise the Lord Praise the Lord Praise the Lord Give God the glory for another day For another week Let me encourage you Stay with us on morning glow Invite your friends We have one more prophetic word to share this morning Close today with Galatians chapter 6 verse 9 And let us not grow weary while doing good for in due season we shall reap if we do not lose heart. I speak into your life today, you shall not be weary. You shall not be derailed. Your assignment will be achieved. You shall not be dissuaded from the purpose of God for your life. May you be strong, may you finish strong, you will not lose heart. Your due season of harvest will manifest you will reap reward of all your hard work. And may your mountains drip with sweetness and the blessings of God. Today will open up to you and produce and provide grace upon grace, blessing upon blessing, grace upon grace, blessing upon blessing, favor upon favor. In Jesus' name, amen, amen, amen. God bless you richly. Dio Steven Diga, Dio Steven Soy, Buana Kubariki, Yamishra, Mwariba Kukumbrere, Womuzitara, Yesu Yibarikish. Nkolunkolu, Abubu says, Good morning, Saobona. Do you need a premier venue to host your next event? The Buckmore Park venue offers versatile event spaces ready to host your function. Hire the 4,000-seater auditorium, ideal for film screenings, concerts and awards nights. The conference hall for seminars, meetings and networking events. Or the Grand Hall, the perfect setting for celebrations and receptions. Set in 25 acres of spacious, scenic woodland, Buckmore Park also boasts free on-site parking, disability access, an events office, audio-visual support and catering facilities. Our friendly sales team will provide you with a seamless experience, keeping your event's needs in mind. To hire an event space within Buckmore Park, call our sales team today on 020-8525-0000. Without injustice, you are good and you are upright. Anybody ready to praise the Lord this morning? Hallelujah! Hallelujah.